Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just a little overwhelmed. Fresh air feels nice. Oh, how you doing, buddy? Oh, he's good. He just had a little too much fun at the park. <laughs> how are you doing? Oh, it's been a bittersweet couple of days. Lucas still hasn't woken up yet. Right. I'm headed there right now, actually. How you holding up? Just trying to keep my mind off that. Keep busy elsewhere so I don't lose my mind. Any luck? I started that KonMari method thing. Oh, yeah, I've heard good things about that. Yeah, yeah, I just needed to do something about all the clutter in my apartment. It's been so chaotic since Peter moved in, so I've been boxing up all of Georgie and James's old clothes to donate them. Breaks my heart to get rid of all that stuff, but somebody else could use it more. Somebody who actually fits in it, unlike Mr. James here, right? Can you believe how much he's grown in the last year? Thank you, Daddy. Welcome, sweetheart. What's the matter with you, huh? I mean, didn't you ever get the talk about, you know, using action? Okay. Willow and I... We... Willow and I were very responsible. All right? And besides, it was a false alarm. Okay, good. Oh, don't get me wrong. Your kids are... Kids are amazing and all that, but I was barely ready to be a father, and I got a few years on you. A few? Hilarious. Well, I mean, hypothetically, what would you have done if, if Willa was pregnant? Look, I'm, I'm not ready to be a father just yet, and, um... But I'm committed to a future with Willow. I love her. So, yeah, if, if she got pregnant, I would be all in. I'm talking the stroller, the minivan, the whole thing. But I'm not going to lie. I was, I was relieved. But I'm not, not going to be a dad just yet. You know, you'll be a good dad when the time comes. But in the meantime, it seems like everything worked out. So what's the problem? I think just the thought of her being pregnant brought back some feelings about Wiley for Willow. It's amazing how fast kids grow at this age. You almost don't recognize them week to week. A couple of months, forget it. Oh my God, I am so sorry. I've been rambling about James and he's not that much older than Wiley. It's okay. No, it's not. I was going on and on about baby clothes. It's and... fine, it's fine. I mean it. You don't have to walk on eggshells with me. Still, I have somewhat of an understanding of how you feel. You do? Yeah. I went through this really messy custody situation with my daughter, Georgie. A custody situation that I created because I thought I could give her up, but it turns out that I couldn't. I'm sorry. It's, it's different with me. I gave Wiley up to protect him from Shiloh. And I can never regret that. I don't regret giving Wiley up for adoption. It's what protected him from Shiloh. I am so grateful that he has two parents who love him. Still, I assume that doesn't make it hurt any less. Not really. Oh, I better run before I miss visiting hours at GH. Bye, sweetie. <laughs> Wiley's always going to be in Willow's heart, but I guess I overestimated how well she's coping with having given him up and now seeing him all the time. Yeah. Oh, no, no. That's got to be hard. I know Anna still grapples with the decision she made to give up Peter all those years ago. 